sort of an understanding of community relations. Um, and I think uh, he's, he's not associated with Ventures on Works, but I think he definitely has a lot to share. Um, and I hope you guys enjoy the talk this afternoon. So, after this, we hear Corey Benjamin. And so we have to remember that we're working with people. 
and that people are really the center of the conversation. You know, I've been able to deepen my understanding and my commitment to this cause as I spend more and more time in Africa um, uh, developing deeper relationships with community members. And one of the things that our team has done is uh, develop relationships with kids, especially kids that are uh, orphans and vulnerable children, don't have caregivers. And um, this was a gal named like, a little girl named Jacobia. And we love Jacobia and her brothers and sisters. And our goal is to help to provide some educational support and, and such. Um, now, something happened to Jacobia. And uh, our volunteers, a couple of gals that work with the organization, really had a deep relationship with her after a while. And one morning, uh, she was fine. Uh, they were playing with her, and everything was good. And they were with her throughout the day, actually. And about midday, she started throwing up. And then she started having diarrhea. And then her whole body started shaking. And so uh, the community members and our volunteers helped to rush her to, a, uh, to, a, to the nearest health clinic. But it was too late. And we actually lost this little girl uh, right in front of our eyes. And uh, it was most likely typhoid or some related issue. It was really hard for us. Um, and it, it, it drove home. Uh, how fragile uh, a life in which uh, we don't have access to the basic things we need to survive and thrive, and how there's so many hazards and threats that are so readily available. And this is a picture of her, uh, her two brothers and her sister uh, about the day after. And so they'd lost their, uh, the fourth of their little cohort. Little cohort. They'd already lost both their parents, and, and now, um, now they've lost their little sister. And the thing about Jacobia is, unfortunately, it's not a unique story. <clears throat> There's about 25,000 children like her that die every single day as a result of sanitation related issues and sicknesses and diarrhea and stuff like this. The deeper that we understand these issues, uh, the deeper that our conviction and our passion comes to play, the more effective we are at organizing ourselves in mobilizing the resources that we need, in really activating um, uh, all of our faculties to be committed and dedicated to service. And that's what's happened for me. See, people that, are, that live in impoverished conditions, they have real needs. complex presentation software, which has a lot of value, but also 